Now, the First Lady, Senator Olurem Tunubu, said that President Bola Tunubu was working toward restoring Nigeria's greatness. She spoke at the State House when she received Ambassador of the United Arab Emirates UAE to Nigeria, Mr. Salim Sahid Halish Masi. Now, she commended the UAE for the confidence and likeness the aunt expressed towards Nigeria and our citizens. Now, the First Lady also thanked the Chief Executive Officer of UAE NGO, the North Foundation, Dr. Manan Tariam, for all it had done for the country, especially its intervention in Carson State in the last four years. She acknowledged that the intervention had saved many citizens from, Biden, uh, from blindness. But, you know, we thank God for the new discovery, new innovations that, you know, we, uh, the world is really embracing which has really helped a lot of people. Uh, thank you so much for the school high screening for students. It's very, very important. Like you said, with all that, it will definitely affect productivity and also, uh, you know, economic impact, which you described. And um, sight is very, very crucial for anyone. And I pray that, you know, uh, the distribution of glasses. I think you'll do that in Lagos as well, you know. So I can just um, thank you for all that No Foundation has brought to Nigeria. Uh, we look forward to more states being impacted by, you know, your gesture. And I love the idea that you take it one state at a time. Uh, earlier, Tariam had said that his organization had, through the provision of free uh, contract, uh, cataract treatment and other eye-related surgeries, treated a lot of people with eye problems in Carson Estates. We've also measured the academic um, performance of the students and the teachers. And one of the results that we found out that there is an increase in the academic attention of the students in class that increased to around 85% which means that a simple treatment of refractive error by providing eyeglasses to students kept them in school and make them academically better. And uh, this year, uh, the program comes to an end. When we say it comes to an end, that doesn't mean that we're going to close it down, no. But we're going to hand it over to the state government. And we're going to work with them by providing free surgeries to those who need it. But everything else is going to continue under the governance of the state government. We still have some optometrists who are under the scholarship of Noor Dubai training in India. We're expecting them to be back in a year and then to find jobs and to work for the government. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.